story. The name of the story is Cafe at the Edge of the Moon. Francesca Simon, author of Howard Henry, illustrated by Pete Williamson. Don't slouch, Jenny, said her mom. Don't slurp, Jenny, said her dad. Eat your sandwich first, said her mom. Chew your toys, Jenny, said her dad. Pull your socks up, Jenny, said her mom. That's not how you're supposed to play with your car, said her dad. Jenny stepped into her racing car and drove away. To the cafe at the edge of the moon. Good evening, madam. Welcome to the cafe. Here's your special table and chair. What would you like to eat? Jenny ordered donuts, fries, wobbly custard, peas, ice cream cake, apple juice with three straws and peaches and macaroni. An excellent choice. She poured juice on her macaroni and fries. She poked her finger through the donut. She played with her peas. She, then she squirted ketchup on her peach and ate that too. No one told her to be quiet. No one told her to use her phone. Excuse me, madam, said the waiter. Do you need more ketchup? Yes, said Jenny. For my custard. When Jenny had finished, she put her feet up on the table. That was the best meal I ever had, said Jenny. Then... Jenny ran to the park next to the cafe at the edge of the moon. She walked up the slide the wrong way, sat in the middle of the seesaw. And back the fence with a stick. She splashed in all. The puddles shouted, I can do whatever I want. And skipped into the sand pit without taking off her shoes. Then Jenny jumped into her car and went for a wild ride. She carried round a crater, streaked across a lake, and scared the plants. Then she raised a blue blush and laughed when she beat him and beeped and beeped and beeped her horn the waiter appeared could we have a little more noise please she said then he yawned and looked at the earth far far away and she 
wondered who fed the goldfish and if her brother was having her bath without her. Won't you be staying for breakfast, madam? asked the goldfish. No, thank you, said Janet. And she zoomed home. said Janice, Mom, anything special you would like to do? Can I do anything I want? asked Jenny. Yes, said her mom. Good, said Jenny. I want to go to bed. It's been quite a day. The end. If you like my story, give me a thumbs up and subscribe my channel. Bye.